Hi guys, I'm Carlo Ira. Welcome sa channel ko. By the way, kung bago ka lang dito sa channel ko, it's all about computer, tips and tricks, life hacks, and everything. Like, subscribe, and click the bell button para lagi kang updated sa mga video na i-upload ko para lang sa'yo. Topic natin ngayon, paano ba gumawa ng bootable flash drive using DOS Command Pro? Materials needed, Power ISO software, at Windows 10 operating system in ISO format. First, open natin yung uh, Power ISO, then click, right click, run as administrator, click yes, click I agree, Click install, then wait for a while. Then makikita nyo complete na. Then click next. Then click select all. Then click close. Makita nyo, automatically magbubukas yung inyong browser. Kapag may internet kayo, makita nyo yung Power ISO na website. Close nyo lang. And then, pwede nyo siyang i-close yung Windows. Then, go to Start button. Then, makikita nyo yung Power ISO. Dapat makikita nyo dito sa inyong My Computer. Pag wala, kailangan nyo siyang i-restart or i-restart mismo yung computer pagka hindi siya automatically nag-ask ng restart permission then restart after mag-restart ng inyong uh, computer balik kayo sa inyong uh, desktop yung windows logo uh, ay by the way yung uh, materials needed palang folder then tingnan nyo dapat mababago na yung inyong uh, windows 10 icon na iso Click and mouse. Then click my computer. Then makikita nyo sa drive D nandun na agad yung inyong Windows 10 na ISO format. Dahil minout natin siya. Then insert na natin yung ating flash drive. Makita nyo ang ating flash drive ay removable disk drive F. Then, go to start uh, search box. Then, type natin CMD. Run as administrator. Then, click yes. Then, type this part. Then, nasa this part uh, window sa tayo. Then, type naman natin na list this. Enter. And then, may dalawa tayong drives. Drive D0 as HDD and this one as flash drive. Then, type natin. Select this one. For flash drive. Then, Enter. Then, this one is now the selected disk. Then, type naman natin clean. Then, enter. This part, succeed in cleaning the disk. Then, type naman natin. Create partition primary. Then, enter. After natin siyang type. Then, type natin. Select partition 1. Then, 
Then type natin again. Active. Then enter. Then type natin format fs equal sign ntfs quick. Then enter. Hintayin natin siya mag 100%. Pag nag 100%, that's the time na itatype natin yung susunod na step. Huwag na huwag nyong kakalimutan lagyan ng quick dahil kapag walang quick, napakatagal nyo. Then, this part successfully formatted the volume. Then, type naman natin, assign, then enter. After natin ma-assign yung ating uh, uh, partition, that's the time na itatype na natin yung exit. After natin ma-exit, huwag nyo muna siyang i-close, hindi pa tayo tapos. Go to our uh, my computer and then check natin yung ating Windows 10 at yung ating flash drive. Ang Windows 10, ang kanyang drive is drive D at ang ating flash drive naman is drive D. Type natin, X copy space D colon slash asterisk dot asterisk space backslash s backslash e backslash f space then yung drive letter ng ating flash type is drive e, e colon slash then enter pag enter natin makikita nyo maraming files na makakapi from drive D going to drive E from Windows 10 uh, Windows 10 operating system na ISO format papunta sa ating flash drive and wait for a while until matapos siya medyo it takes time depende sa da laki ng inyong operating system na pinakapit kung Windows 10 siya medyo matagal siya kasi ang kanyang capacity or volume is or more than 4 gig or less than 4 gig. Yeah. It depends sa laki ng inyong operating system na ikinakapi papunta sa inyong flash drive. Kaya mag lang tayo ng medyo hindi ganun katagal. Pero it takes a while. By the way guys, kapag ka kayo ay gagawa ng bootable flash drive, huwag na huwag nyo siyang i-cancel o huwag na huwag nyo bubunutin yung inyong flash drive kasi may tendency hindi na gumana yung flash drive nyo or makurap. Once na siya ikinagawang bootable flash drive, dapat kayo ay nakasecure at wala kahit na ano ang pwedeng gumalaw ng flash drive or else sira yung flash drive nyo at makukurap siya. Kaya, dapat secure at walang magulo kapag kayo ay gumagawa ng flash By the way, pagkatapos natin ito, yung flash drive na magagawa natin, ang tawag na ay bootable flash drive. Pag in-insert nyo siya sa inyong computer, dadaan kayo sa tinatawag na simuseta or irarun nyo na yung inyong bootable flash drive para makapag-install lang kayo ng Windows 10 sa inyong laptop or sa inyong computer. Kapalit siya ng CD before 
na dati ay CD ang gamit natin to format or to install operating system. Now, dahil na medyo na pace out na yung mga DVD ROM at hindi na masyadong ginagamit ngayon yung mga CD, nauso na ngayon yung bootable flash drive. Na instant, pag kininsert nyo sa inyong computer at nirestart nyo yung computer at pinadaan nyo sa boot, boot menu, automatically mag install na siya ng parang kapareho ng CD format ng way ng pag install Kaya, yeah. napakaganda rin ng uh, bootable flash drive kasi is napakaliit lang nung pwede nyo dalhin. By the way, ito na. Pag nakita nyo sa inyong computer yung 101 file copied o basta may nakita kayong finished not copied, that's the time na tapos na kayong mag-install o kung gumawa ng bootable flash drive. Then, restart yung computer yung computer for installation. Then, go to boot menu. After matapos natin, uh, gawin yung bootable flash drive, insert na natin yung ating flash drive sa ating computer or laptop. And then, press natin yung ating boot menu. For example, is F12. Sa aking laptop is F12. Press lang natin ng maraming beses until lumabas yung ating setup menu. And then, makita nyo, lalabas na yung inyong USB. Click nyo lang yung USB natin. Example is Kingstone Data Traveler 3.0. Then, enter. Then, wait lang natin lumabas yung logo ng ating uh, Windows 10. Indication na tayo ay ready for installation at working yung ginawa natin bootable flash. That's it. Kung nagustuhan mo itong video na to, at if you want more videos like this, mag-comment ka lang sa baba. Thanks for watching. Subscribe.